Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to update drivers on your Windows 11 computer. So this should be a pretty straightforward process, guys. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump straight into it. So all you have to do is a couple different ways on how to do it, actually. First thing I'd recommend doing would be to open up the start menu and type in Windows Update. Go ahead and select Check for Updates. should be one of the best matches here. And go ahead and actually check for updates and see if there are any updates available. And then you likely would have to restart your computer for any changes to take effect. And now another way you can check for updates too would be to open up the start menu again and search for device manager. Best result should come back with device manager. Go ahead and open that up. And now locate whatever driver you want to update. So let's say display adapter. Right click on whatever display adapter you want to update and select update driver. You can search automatically for drivers, which will allow Windows to search your computer for the best available driver and install it on your device. However, you can also search for updated drivers on Windows Update 2, which just takes us back to our first step. Alternatively, you can also browse my computer for drivers. So if you select that, you can also select let me pick from a list of available drivers on my computer and then go through the manufacturer driver installation. Now, if you have a generic driver, you can select it, but generally, if you have a manufacturer one, I'd recommend prioritizing that one. And then you'd select next, go through the installation process, and then you should restart your computer. Alternatively, as a third method, you can go onto the manufacturer's website and download the drivers directly from them. Most utilities have automated tools that you don't even have to go through device manager anymore. You can just actually just run an executable file and it will install it all in one for you. You don't actually have to go and locate the files anymore, but that's very specific for a specific driver and I don't really want to go down the rabbit hole too much with any one driver. I've already done them for display drivers like NVIDIA, AMD, Intel. You can search my channel specifically for those more personalized or individualized walkthroughs. But that's pretty much it for today's tutorial. And as always, thank you for watching this brief tutorial. Do hope that I was able to help you out. And I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.